Chapter 13, more on the Big Bang. Modern scientists claim that the universe is expanding from the Big Bang. They look through their telescopes and use other modern methods to deduce that the galaxies are moving away from the Earth and from each other. From these deductions, they come to the conclusion that the universe must be expanding as a result of their Big Bang, which says that the universe started as an explosion and all celestial bodies continue to move outward in all directions because of that explosion. This is an erroneous interpretation of scientific data. Their perception is correct that the galaxies are moving away from the Earth and from each other, but to use that information to jump to the conclusion that the universe must be expanding is an error. I will try to explain the situation by using an example that is close to home and is therefore much easier to comprehend. Let us hypothetically say there are short-lived beings on Mars who only live for three months. Their scientists look through their telescopes at our Earth, Venus, Jupiter, and other planets. Let us say the first time they look, the Earth happens to be moving away from Mars, as it does actually periodically. And let us assume also that at the same period, Venus and Jupiter are also moving away from Mars, as they also do periodically. Now, because these scientists are very short-lived, having a lifespan of only three months, during their observations, they will see the Earth moving away from Mars for the entire duration of their lifespan because the Earth will move around the sun away from them for about three months, then turn and move in another direction for another three months, and so on until it completes a full revolution in one year. But because these scientists only live for three months, they will not be able to see the Earth coming around and moving back closer to Mars. They can only see it moving away in their lifetime. And so, if they are like modern Earth scientists, they will come to the conclusion that our solar system is expanding because the planets are moving away from each other. To see the situation as it really is, using only their telescopes, they would have to wait many lifetimes until other scientists collect more data and see the Earth coming around and back toward Mars, and then move away again, then come back again, etc., as it revolves round and round the Sun. Then they would come to the correct conclusion that the solar system is not expanding, but rather the planets move around the Sun, sometimes going away from Mars and other times approaching Mars. That is precisely the situation with all the galaxies. The only problem is that the revolutionary circuits of galaxies are so large that it would take millions of years for Earth scientists to collect all the necessary data using their modern methods. At the present time, no matter how long they make their observations, they will only see the galaxies that they are watching moving away. They will not see them make a turn and come around and start moving towards our galaxy. They will seem to continue to be moving away forever in the same direction because their orbital circuit around the galactic sun takes millions of years to complete. The modern methods of astronomical observation are extremely inadequate for observing celestial bodies whose periods of revolution are millions or billions of years long. This in itself would not necessarily lead to all these erroneous conclusions. Using proper logic, they could still discover the truth, but the problem is that they are handicapped by previous preconceived notions, namely their theory of the Big Bang. As soon as they observed that some galaxies were moving away from our galaxy, they immediately took that as confirmation of their Big Bang theory. According to this theory, the universe must indeed expand because it started as a localized explosion, and the nature of an explosion is to expand outward in all directions. Because of this false theory, they are logically handicapped. It prevents them from using logic to see that galaxies behave exactly like planets in a solar system. They revolve back and forth around their galactic suns, those in one galactic group moving away from those in another group for millions of years, then moving towards each other for millions more.